हेलो एवरी वन आई एम डॉक्टर कल्याण आई एम ए सीनियर न्यूरो सर्जन एंड स्पाइन सर्जन फ्रॉम हैदराबाद आई एम स्पेशली ट्रेंड इन की ओल्स फाइन सर्जरीज एंड की ओल्स कल बेस सर्जरीज आर एंडोस्कोपिक्स फाइन सर्जरीज एंड एंडोस्कोपिक्स कल बेस सर्जरीज आई हैव एक्सटेंसिव एक्सपीरियंस इन डीलिंग विद वेरियस कंडीशन ऑफ स्पाइन एंड ब्रेन वॉट कॉजेज शियाटिका शियाटिका इज लो बैक पेन बिकॉज ऑफ ए स्लिप डिस्क कंप्रेसिंग ऑन इन अब्रोड so i'm sure this explains what causes sciatica sciatica is because of a disc within your spinal cord the what you call an intervertebral disc this because of degeneration because of various causes comes out which is called as a prolapse this compresses in nerve root and this causes pain along your leg so first question we'll try to answer what causes slipping of the disc the disc are you can imagine this disc our back vertebral column is made up of a number of small bones which are known as vertebra in between to each bone two bones there is a, a soft cushion like material which is known as a intervertebral disc this disc acts as a cushion this cushioning is important suppose you imagine if our vertebral body is made up of a single bone then you are you are going to be very stiff you can't bend forward or back so what has what has god done god has done that our vertebral column is made up of a number of small bones each bone is known as a vertebra in between two vertebra we have a cushion like material which is known as a disc or an intervertebral disc this intervertebral disc is just like a cushion it has an overlying layer which is like the leather over a cushion and the center portion which is made up of which is known as the core nucleus pulposus which is like your cotton which is cotton within a cushion so anything which disturbs the health of this intervertebral disc decreases its functional ab- ability decreases the way it acts as a cushion the overlying layer breaks the cotton like material comes out this cotton like material will compress the nerve root causing sciatica so what are the thing which impairs the healthness are the activity functional capability capability of this disc an improper posture an improper posture increases the pressure within the disc as the pressure within the disc increases it causes a crack in the overlying layer which is called as annulus what kind of postures a posture which involves a lot of bending or which involves which causes a lot of weight of your body to pass through the intervertebral disc causes an increase in intervertebral pressure so bending squatting these are two common postures which increases the pressure within the disc second one is improper exercises the exercises strengthen the disc and also they strengthen the muscles and bones surrounding the disc if you are not taking care care of your back if you are not exercising regularly this impairs the integrity of the disc along with this one smoking and alcohol they also affect they also affect the health of the disc nutrition in the form of a lot of vitamins antioxidants a lot of water to ensure the hydration of the disc are also important and loss of hydration is usually the first cause of dehydration of the disc and causing a disc and causing a disc prolapse in addition to this rarely trauma to the disc infections of the disc like tuberculosis cancers of the spine can also cause sciatica